New this morning, Supreme Court nominee Brett Kavanaugh is speaking out against multiple misconduct allegations. Last night, he made rare public comments, rare for a Supreme Court nominee. Channel 3's Eva Zamaris joins us live now from Yale Law School, where Kavanaugh attended school with a closer look at how students are reacting. Eva. Well, good morning to you both. There was a sit-in and a walkout yesterday here at Yale. Some students are now demanding an investigation into the allegations against him. No, I've never sexually assaulted anyone, not in high school, not ever. Supreme Court nominee Brett Kavanaugh went on Fox News last night and defended himself against sexual misconduct allegations. A former classmate, Christine Blasey Ford, claims Kavanaugh sexually assaulted her at a house party while they were in high school. Both of them are slated to go before the Senate later this week. A second woman has also come forward with another accusation, going back to when they were students at Yale in the early 80s. She claims Kavanaugh exposed himself to her during a drinking game when they were freshmen. President Donald Trump came to his defense, calling this political. On Capitol Hill and at Yale Law School, Democratic senators joined protesters to demand an FBI investigation. Whatever your views on Brett Kavanaugh, for or against, you should be in favor of reopening this investigation, allowing the FBI to uncover the facts and evidence. Now, the public hearing with Kavanaugh and his first accuser is set for Thursday in Washington. I'll have much more on this story coming up in our next half hour. But for now, live in New Haven this morning, I'm Evan Zamaris, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.